Blue G9 Pro Review The Blue G9 Pro is an interesting phone right from the get-go. It has a powerful processor, the MediaTek Helio P60, that is normally reserved for premium level phones and interesting design choices, like a rear-mounted fingerprint sensor that make it stand apart from the herd. This combination of quality and strangeness, or quality and individualism, has earned the G9 Pro the distinction of being a best smartphone. Blue may not be a household name in the mobile phone market, but with the release of the Blue G9 Pro it's safe to say it's trying its hardest to make it so. The G9 Pro is probably the most budget, a budget phone can be, but also the most powerful a budget phone can be. The G9 Pro boasts a powerful 24MP front camera which is a nice addition for those who will be using it primarily as a selfie camera. It has a triple camera rear setup consisting of a 16MP main camera, a 5MP depth camera and a 20MP night mode camera. Unfortunately, portrait mode on the front camera is horrendous. The UMI Digi X features an incredible camera for a budget phone, if phone cameras are your decision maker. Moving on to performance, 2.0 GHz Octa-Core MediaTek Helio P60 makes the phone faster and more fluid over its predecessor, the Blue G9. In a bold design choice, the fingerprint sensor on the G9 Pro is rear-mounted, located about three-quarters of the way up on the phone. Not only does this bring some novelty, it also sets it apart from the herd of in-display fingerprint sensor phones. In an amazing turn of events, the G9 Pro has a USB-C port and a headphone jack. Just another bold and novel design choice from the people at Blue. And you don't have to throw away your old headphones. If bold design choices are your thing, consider the Razer Phone 2 where bold design and performance choices lead to features like better gaming. The Blue G9 Pro features wireless charging. This is another nice addition as wireless charging is a feature normally reserved for higher-end, flagship phones. By all accounts, the G9 Pro is about as solid as a mid-range phone, or budget phone, can get. By now, many companies have mid-range cell phones. Even Samsung has the Samsung Galaxy A70 which is the mid-range version of their trademark Galaxy S series. But not many can match what the Blue G9 Pro is offering at a measly $200. The people at Blue are leading the way not only in the cheapest budget phone available, but also on bold design and performance choices. There was a time when Apple was the leader, but now it seems they have fallen into a comfortable routine. Let's hope Blue, when they become a household name, don't fall victim to the same trap. Thanks for watching, please subscribe for more upcoming videos.